they go doing me now. I'm still a talk of the town. Running the scissors, I'm poking them down. We turn the smiles into frowns. Gang hop out, then we clear on the. Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Cody from Talk of the Town. Today we have a special guest, Luda. Yo, it's him. How you feeling? Since you've been in New York. Tired. Tired. I ain't been asleep. You know, we but I fought with the here. atmosphere though. I, I like it though. That's what you're supposed to be doing. Everybody up, moving, working. Yeah. It's two or four hours over here. We, we always working over here. Yeah, yeah. Is it the same way in Atlanta or no? Hell yeah, no. Nah. So, like, I mean, Atlanta, it's starting to be that way though. Now that you say that, yeah. it's starting to be that way. Like, never sleep. Ain't nobody never sleep. I was about to say, like, what would be the cutoff time if there was? That's what I'm and saying. Atlanta, like, uh, it's about to be the same. Cut out time, say at least two o'clock. That's when all the food plays club, cool. I think. Nah, you can still come for <laughs> See, at two o'clock, you probably be sh shit out of luck. Okay. You can find food, but it ain't gonna be what you want. Right. So, we're gonna play a quick game, rapid fire questions. I'm gonna just ask you a question, just answer it real quick. So, what's your sign? Libra. What's your favorite slang word? Yo. Not a slang word. That doesn't really count. Word. No. Twin. I was a twin, probably. Yeah, twin. Okay. okay. What's your favorite album? Hmm. It's a good one. It's a good word. I'm gonna go with uh favorite album. No skips. No skips. I'm gonna go with Lil Wayne. Car. Which one? You better say the right one. <laughs> the one where he had the baby picture. Carter three. Carter three. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What's one thing on your bucket list? <laughs> Woo! What thing on my bucket list? I'm gonna give you one of them. What's on my bucket list? Jump out of the plane. The mountain? Yeah. Okay. Skydive. For sure, for sure. Who, well, who's your favorite artist outside of hip hop? Like, do you listen to R&B, country, pop? Yeah, I like uh, I like Adele. Okay. Lauren Hill. I like a lot of old school. Who else I can say that is? I listen to Adele, Lauren Hill. Yeah, we gave us two. That's valid. Yeah. What's your um what's your dream collaboration? Or goal? Like what's a goal collab for you? Me and goddamn I feel like me and uh Brent Fire is. Really? Gold collab. Hey, sleeping on Brent. I ain't gonna say that Gold yet. collab. Right, so yeah, that's it for rapid fire questions. Let's get into it. So, yeah. tell us where you're from. I'm from Atlanta. I'm from the Swats. The Swats over in the zone for. Okay, and what it's like growing up over there? Uh, it is what you make it. You mind your business and do the right thing, then you're going to get the right thing. But you get curious, then curious shit happens. Okay, okay. So, um, are you still over there or no? Uh, am I still over there? Yeah. Hell no. Okay, okay. Okay, I'm just yeah, I, I don't no. know. <laughs> I mean, I mean, yeah, I go over there, but I ain't still, still over, over there. there. Like I know. Some people some artists feel like they don't want to leave their hood or their city. Yeah, you better get your ass up out of there for somebody else make you come leave that motherfucker. Is that something you learned or is that some advice somebody told you or it just made it's the most sense for you? Typical situation? learning. Okay. Typical. All right. So how'd you get into music? Uh I always really been into music, but I really started getting into music like 2019. I started recording. So COVID. Yeah, like COVID's when that shit hit. Yeah, COVID. That's okay. when I really got into music. So, what's your first musical experience? Did you go to the studio? Was you in the studio with your friends? Like, how'd you get into it? I wasn't. You want to know something crazy? No. I wasn't even with my friends. Like some niggas I don't hang with, but then my bro, I like I fuck with them. The associates, really. but not the day ones. Yeah, okay. so and they was just like they go to the studio, and we go to the studio. They pay for the studio time. Mm -hmm. 
And I went in there and rap. And that shit sounded good. And it sounded better than all that shit. So they were like, <laughs> damn. Okay, so was he freestyling? Was he writing? Like I was freestyling. Okay. So freestyling it was still better than you said. Okay. Yeah. So um who was you listening to growing up? We know Lil Wayne. Like who else? Uh everybody, Soldier Slim, T I. Mm-hmm. Uh who else? Dro. I'm naming all the other people. I know, I can see. <laughs> Dip set. You feel me? Dip set, put them in there. Who else I could put in there? Just no, I really listen to many. That's cool. Like that's what you kinda that was what you were seeing growing up. Yeah. So like um so when did you I guess start did you, was you keeping and listening to people? Like basically like was when you was writing, well you never wrote. You said you was freestyling. So you never I had wrote, yeah, I had wrote. Okay. I went I always So you don't I like writing? Wrote. No, because I feel like what I'm trying to Writing is better than what you're trying to say because it, it's going to, uh, it's more thought about your words and more thought about, mm-hmm. but you can't really get what you're trying to say off if you're not in that vibe. You get what I'm saying? Okay. When you writing, you just got to write, create the vibe, but okay. when you do the music, you actually got to do the music. Okay. So would you write like in the studio or before the studio? Before the studio. I write right at home. Okay. And I learned that's not like good either because you'll get in the studio and, and it's, It'll be a different delivery put on it or something. Okay. So tell us about your project on the way. This project is real, real, real special. Okay. And even if you don't like music or you don't like a certain type of music, I feel like you should give it a try on this project because it got something for everybody. But it got something for like, okay, you like that type of genre? You like that type of genre? Versatile. Okay, so what inspired this? Like, what made you want to put this together? Like, what's the goal? What do you want people to take away? Uh, just want to take my career serious. Okay. You feel me? Mm-hmm. I feel like just me taking it serious actually take me to the next level still. Okay, you have any features on the tape? No features. And I should have had, I know I should have had some features because... I got I got gateway to a lot of features, you feel me? But You wanna go I organic? Know, yeah, I did no features. Cool. Yeah, I did no features. Okay. Okay, maybe a deluxe or you know. Yeah, that. deluxe can deluxe with some features? Yeah. Okay, so what's your favorite song on the tape? So if someone never heard your music, tape on the way, what's the first song you want them to hear? Or what's the one you feel Listen like is the one? It's one of the best ones. I mean, if you, okay, all right, so to get to know me, to understand, like, who the fuck is this nigga? Mm-hmm. You should listen to a round of applause. Okay. But to, uh, to like, know my comfort zone in music, you should listen to going down. Uh, like, you some like, some, like, girly music. Okay. That's, like, my comfort zone. Okay. So what kind of vibe is your music, would you say? Are you, like, car music? Maybe, like, club party turn-up music? I know you got different vibes, but, like, what's your pocket you feel like? I like to make the music you could just ride to, you mean, but you're not turnt. Okay. Like, damn, this shit riding. Good, song. right? Good Level ride. Level okay. heart, heart shit, like, heartfelt shit. And then uh, I can make, make turn-up music, too, but mm-hmm. I like making chill music. Okay. Okay. So, you know, the girls kind of be making a turn up music. Do you listen to female artists? No. What? I mean, don't get me wrong. <laughs> I turn on some sex every now and then, but I don't really listen to. I feel like that you can't you you gonna hear sexy in the club if you go outside. Yeah, cause she sound like a goddamn. <laughs> you feel me? She got the 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 ratchetness in her voice. She got the rawness in her shit. You can hear you can hear it. Okay. Any other female artists? Or any art any female you artists you would collab with? How you gonna get me in trouble because there's some female artists that I that I follow right now. I don't think I remember all their names. Okay, so who do you feel like you'll do great on a song with? It don't even have to be who you listen to. Okay, uh Musically, who you trying to any girls? Musically, who's some 
Who you sound good with? Maybe. I do a song with uh, Summer Walker. Summer Walker sounds good. Song. Okay. Uh, her. Most deal. Okay, so the R and B girlies, you trying to work with? Yeah, man, I ain't really trying to. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I ain't trying to uh, turn up, turn up, turn up. All the time. <laughs> I will though. <laughs> to go get turned up, you gotta go get sexy. Yeah, yeah. Mm. All right, so we know that you connected in the industry. How did you um, meet little baby? Oh, we from the same same area. Okay, and then like so, when he knew about you working on music or. Y'all kind of talked about it later, or? You said, did he know? You said, like, like, when you was doing music, was he, like, supporting your music? And, like, y'all was yeah. locked in? Or, yeah. Oh, from day one? Yeah. Type I made my life. first song, and he just, he was listening to that bitch. I was surprised. <laughs> you know? How you found out? I was there. Okay. <laughs> and they cut your shit But on? not a, uh, they, everybody was telling me, like, he keep this to your song, but he was listening to the song. When he was in front of me, you know, but they didn't tell me how many times he was listening to it. Okay. And I feel like in Atlanta, y'all be locking in, like, with producers. Do you have one set producer you locked in with? Yeah. That'd be Chi-Chi. And how'd y'all meet? Uh, that's crazy. I met Chi-Chi in, some, in, in somebody else's hood. I was going out there to go gamble, I think. Chi-Chi was just out there just chilling. I'm like, bro, I be using your beats. <laughs> on YouTube. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I told him. We just locked in. Okay, and that was... So, he did the, most of the project? I mean, most mm -hmm. of the album? Yeah. Okay. Is there any other producers that you fuck with? Yeah, it's a lot of them. Because I was about to say, in Atlanta, it's probably a lot of them. It's a lot. Okay, so... In the music scene out here, we got, like... It's like sexy drill now. We got Ice Spice vibes. In Atlanta, what's the yeah. music scene like out there? Like, <laughs> drill. <laughs> it's still drill out there. Too? We don't reverse to y'all, man. Y'all done did all the yelling shit. Now we yelling. But that's <laughs> that's like that's like what's on the scene now though. It's a whole lot of just, you know. Okay. So drill. where do you see yourself in the Atlanta music scene? Are you trying to create your own lane? Are you trying to make the melodies back a thing? Like what's what's your goal? That's like my goal to make the melodies back the thing, but I think everybody when they listen to me they understand they get that. Like okay. He, he melodic. Okay. And um, before you start doing, if you wasn't doing music, what do you think you would have been doing? Mm. I don't know. I graduated high school. I wanted to go to college, mm -hmm. but I couldn't go because some shit happened. You feel like it's too late to go to school? Or you feel like you don't need to now? I just feel like I need to handle this chapter in my life. And then we go back to school and do whatever. whatever. <laughs> okay. I mean, because I got my, I got a level based education. Mm -hmm. I feel like I can handle what I'm doing right now. When I get this out of the way, I go focus on a higher education. Okay. All right, so what motivates you to keep going? Like Family. Family means a lot to me. Like, I care more about them than me. Mm. Okay. So your family are supportive of the music? Yeah. Yeah, my family very supportive. Was there anybody that like wasn't supportive of the music? They wanted you to go different? Yeah. I mean, I feel like my mom wanted me to go a different route too. Just she wasn't understanding what I was trying to do. Okay. I just not getting a picture, you get what I'm saying? Yeah, no, I get that. But parents do that though. Yeah, it's a different time for them. They don't you want know. you wasting your time or you feel like you need. Yeah. Yeah, it's different now, especially with social media and everything. So um, we're going to play one more game. So pretty much, every time you're doing stuff throughout the day, you're playing music, right? So mm -hmm. this game's called Music Library. So let's say when you're cleaning around the house, what song would you play? In the Ari, good man. <laughs> that's the cleaning vibe? Yeah, that's that cleaning vibe. I don't know nothing about the In the Ari, man. Okay, so when you're cooking, I don't know how to cook. Like, okay, but so let's say just chilling around the house. Chilling around the house, yeah. I go with like uh, hmm, old school or shanty or something. Okay, like the early two thousand shanty. 
Oh, you want to take it back? Okay, okay. All right. So, um, when you're down, what do you play? What are you playing? Man, I be playing all the uh, all the white people sad <laughs> songs. Man. All the white people sad. Songs. Yeah, man. Uh, what's that? James Arthur, Train Wreck. Oh wow. That okay. shit. That like. I found that song on TikTok. Like that, yeah. I'm like, damn, this is touch for shit. <laughs> you gonna die in your motherfucker. I like I like Jane Arthur though. I like music that you can you can feel though. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Whether it's good or bad. I just like music you can feel. Mm-hmm. Okay, when money hits your account. Or when you just get some money, what you playing? Shit. <laughs> I'm thinking. I need my head clear. <laughs> no music right now. <laughs> Yeah, when he, no, I don't be playing no music. I don't know. No, it'll be a good day. Money just hit your account. No, okay. So I mean, maybe that's a good thing. I don't know. Yeah, maybe it's a good <laughs> thing. Cause nigga, I'm already in debt. So I get money like that. <laughs> man. Damn, I gotta think about this. This, this. Thing. All right. So you leaving the club? You with a vibe in the car? For sure. What? What's, what's you playing? How you? Yeah. What you playing? Leaving the club. Five in the car. That's when you get. Are we going sexy red? Nah, hell no. Y'all just at the club, so we got to turn it down. That's when you turn on the the, the brick fires and. Okay. You feel me? Okay, that's when that comes in. Start smooth. Okay. Okay. Um, you smoke? Yeah, I smoke weed. Rolling up. Or in the scythe? What you playing? Are you listening to music? Or you got me in the studio? I do music so much. I I don't know. I hate listening. To it. I gotta be like in the mood. Okay. If you like, I can't listen to. Uh, but I be stuck listening to R and B or something. That deal with I feel like that shit keep my mind at a level I can do music still. Okay. I can't listen to it, but I'm stuck sound like that. <laughs> I feel that. Okay, so you really into R and B? That's good. Are that's that's like, all that just showed all these questions like that. <laughs> this nigga you, really on some cool. R and B shit. So do you feel like? But nah, I like the genre though. But I'm, I be on some gangster shit. But I like the genre though. Nah, it's cool. It's cool if you like R and B. Do you feel like you're a lover boy or no? Yes. Okay. Fair all the way. Okay. I I can be like, uh, cause it can go lover boy manipulator. It, it. <laughs> wow, the transparency here, guys. Yeah, yeah, it's just like it can go two ways. All right, so how is it now dating? Are you dating or no? Because like you going up now, so I'm pretty sure. Yeah, in Atlanta, you gotta have a girlfriend. Just being honest, well, not a girlfriend, but you gotta have, have a consistent situation. Yeah. 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 So I know the girls be like doing, trying to extort y'all. <laughs> You can start <laughs> shit out of me because I don't need you. <laughs> that's what, and, and that's what I start like, man, I don't need you. You feel me? Same way y'all look at us like a tool, look at y'all like a tool. I feel like girls are trying to be a bit more independent. I don't know about in Atlanta, but in New York, man. Y'all independent by asking. <laughs> Maybe me. that's a later day. I don't know. Yeah, I'm telling you. I'm telling you now. It's a learner. It ain't nobody. It ain't got nothing to do with you. It's a learner. Okay. Let me start saying that. Though, well, y'all, I know I'm going to front. In Atlanta, y'all are OD flashy, though. Like yeah, in New yeah. York, we're not about to see nobody with ice and stuff. So we Bitch, never fresh know. your hair, got on the watch and everything. Bro, <laughs> fuck you up, man. <laughs> fuck your whole day up. Like, here, damn. I thought she really was the one. You feel me? That's why you can't fall off everything. I don't know how New York play. What you mean? Like, how y'all, like. Well, like, I feel like in Atlanta, y'all OD flashy. I mean, like, exactly. A bitch will look her tax bracket out here. You have no (laughs) reason to be looking like a mean there if you ain't got. So, like, usually the the get money people would be like in the suburbans, but out there, y'all got four rims and y'all be having y'all. Y'all cars and y'all be having car meets and stuff. Yeah, we don't really have. I don't yet. go to that shit. I'm just that saying. That shit is <laughs> lame as hell. I mean, I. But you I, know what I'm I like cars. I'm in love with cars. Yeah. But I'm not risking myself to meet up with a thousand niggas with other cars getting drunk. No, man. Y'all that, just dumb as hell. From when I'm be watching vlogs and stuff, that look fun. Like, I don't know. 
Yeah, cause bitch, you know, yeah, everything gonna look fun well, when the girls cause... make it look fun. <laughs> You okay. feel me? They ain't finna be out there straight niggas out there watching the car. Man, I'm finna go. And it's also, it's your everyday, because you live in Atlanta, so. I don't, bro. So I probably been like the one of them. I don't go to them bitches. Yeah. That's cool. It's a lot of stuff. So what you do for fun then, if you don't be, like, what you, are you in that house? Play the game. Play the game. I'll say uh, the game. Right? So you be on stream? Nah, I need to start streaming, though, because I be talking mad shit on them. <laughs> How New York be? I be talking mad shit, B. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> so what games are you playing? Call of Duty. Okay. That's a little voice play. Yeah. So you'd be on a game for like a minute. Like so you could stream. Streaming, they be streaming for like hours. And that's extra bread too. If I can smoke on them, I can't play that shit for hours and not smoke. You gotta keep my attention. Yeah, I don't know if you can smoke on the stream. You can't. I don't think so. I think on the kick you can, but Twitch oh, probably not. Okay, so you feel like you, you play the game? I know people that play the game. <laughs> you might can play the game like a motherfucker. I be man. watching yeah. streams though. Like I be, you know what I be watching? I be watching in GTA how they be like narrating their stories. Yeah, that's hard. I'm gonna <laughs> get in there too. I'm gonna get into it too. Probably when GTA Six come out though. Okay, so we gonna see you on GTA. Yeah, you gonna see me up there in the motherfucker. Are you gonna make a stream or nah? Straight music. Stream. I do stream. You said what? But. What they be doing? They swat the house. What? That well, shit you, ain't what. That, that shit. That that's what throw me off. Like, oh, so, so they just come swat them motherfucker. I got shit going on. Me just can't pull up. Yeah. So allegedly, if it, you on there a long time or whatever, and people leak your address, the cops could allegedly come. I only seen it happen to Aiden and somebody else. But some of them was fake too. I, I seen it happen to Speed too. But yeah. Yeah, all I'm saying is that shit ain't cool. I mean, man. if you just playing the game sometimes, like, you're not about to make that your career, that's their career. Right. 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 Yeah, right. So this is like a little part-time stream, but full-time music. They, so, yeah, they ain't, they ain't got no business fucking with yeah, me. Yeah, they ain't gonna mess with you. Yeah, they gonna look over me. <laughs> I might do get in the stream, you know. Maybe. So, I'll be on the way. Yeah, five minutes of fame. Release date? May 10th. Okay. Everywhere. Okay. Mother's Day is coming up too. That's crazy. Are you, are you doing something with your mom's? She been tearing my ass up. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? But. I mean, but, what, you was probably uh, doing that to her when you was a kid, you know? Yeah. But, yeah, so. I don't know though, because I don't think I cost that much how she cost me. I don't, I don't know. But, yeah, I'm, I'm going to do something special for um, my great grandma, my mom, my aunties. My little sister, nice. just, uh, just all the ladies in the film. Nice. Are you doing the um, album release party? Yeah. In Atlanta, though, you got to come back to the city. You show, I'm going to show you how Crazy. we feel. I definitely want to. I went to Atlanta like twice. You forward? Yeah. I was in the closet, though. The See, me, I'm one of them niggas that, you feel me? I play the club for an hour, get up out of there. Yeah, I see people be in and out or they um, come like at the very end. Yeah, I just like the vibe, you know, call kick it. Yeah, I don't know. You stay in the club all night and get drunk, like, mm, till no. they start playing the slow songs? No. Uh, yeah, no. Once I'm lit, I'll be ready to go get food, and then, yeah. We yeah. Up. See, me, I got to have food. and That's the whole point of coming to the club, though, to get the food. Eat at the, we don't eat at the club out here. Y'all don't? No. So, y'all yeah, can't order no lamb chops and rice in there while you in the club? Nobody's, if you go to a New York club, nobody's sitting there eating. We standing on couches, we popping about, that's it. Nigga serious, B. <laughs> like, <laughs> Niggas mad real, yo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it don't be, it's going to be some dancing too, though, but like nobody sitting and eating. Why though? I don't know. Like, we Y'all got a lot of after. rats, though. <laughs> what? That has nothing to do with the club. We uh, do have a lot of rats, but that has nothing to do with the club. Yeah, a lot of clubs don't deserve food. Out I think y'all need to uh, start doing that, though. Eating at the club? Nah, we have diners that this, do 24 hours and shit, like, and stuff like that. So. Diners, though. But if you can get a full course meal at the club. Nobody in New York is thinking full course meal at the club. Like, that shit yeah. is not a thing, bro. It ain't? No. Yeah. Bro, that's We used to go in there thinking how many bottles, how many, I mean, like. So we the only one that get full course meal at the club. <laughs> well, you, I don't know. Like, you can get drunk and get a full course meal. Damn, that's crazy. So what y'all eat at the club? Chop cheese? 
No. That shit make you right, shit, you man. Bad. Okay. So, I don't know no. about y'all, man. Shit have so a nigga like, on the toilet. At, like man. Starless, they have lamb chops and shit, but nobody ordered it. Like niggas is smoking hookah, drinking. Niggas is smoking hookah. <laughs> well, when I say niggas, I'm diabolical. Oh my man, God. what is going on here? <laughs> Well, people, the girls are right. smoking hookah. Mind my business. Okay, well, album on the way. I was in New York man. for like five minutes, y'all. <laughs> yeah, I fall in New York, though. I like that here. Don't nobody be stunning nobody. In Atlanta, nigga, look you down the face walking down the sidewalk. Nah. Now I hear people, you know, like I said, everybody moving, trying to do something, trying to get something. Yeah, everybody on a mission out here. Fast pace. I feel like I supposed to be from out here. You said what? I feel like I supposed to be from out here. Mm, you might like Elena better. <laughs> now that you say that, yeah, I do. Yeah, like the laws is different here. It's just, mm -hmm. it's, it's closer here. I'm down south, You think baby. you about to be far away from people? <laughs> no, you gonna go outside and see all the homies. Then how I wonder. No. Nah. Y'all still got the project. We don't got projects no more. Huh? Y'all still got our projects. Yeah. We don't got projects no more. See, like, yeah, that's the thing. So the projects is like five buildings, 12, 11 floors. That's Ain't a no big sneaking ass a project, girl so. in and out of there. Like, it's none of that. That's a long ass sneak trying to get me down. <laughs> really? like, you stay on 15th that, floor. Bro. That's what I said. You don't want to do New York. <laughs> then you got rats and stuff. Yeah. Yeah, so how was going up out here? Let me interview you. Huh? How well growing up out here? What um, part of New York you from? I'm from downtown Brooklyn. Downtown Brooklyn? Yeah. What's it, so what's <laughs> different than other in the other Brooklyn? No, it's like it's like the other Brooklyn dirty or something? No, no, no. I don't say where I'm from. It's like that's like what we call the area. So it's like Brownsville, it's East New York, it's like I mean it's different parts of Brooklyn. And then every hood is different though. Yeah. But every hook got projects. I be watching them Brooklyn stores on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, them boy. Huh. We be seeing Atlanta stories too. Yeah, I be watching y'all shit. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Cops be heavy out here though. Cops be heavy out there in Atlanta. They aggressive out here. I be seeing niggas chilling. Yeah. They just got caught. Walk up on go see your pocket. No, they real aggressive out here. Yeah, that's robbery in Atlanta. <laughs> <laughs> You got to kind of just go. And when I was in the the cops like, was like, mind their business. Like, it don't give, unless y'all into something. Right? You talking yeah. about it. Yeah, yeah. Unless, yeah. Unless, unless, you, unless you're into something, you ain't got to worry about nothing too much. Yeah. Like, nope, out here, if you look suspicious, they on your ass. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Well, as you can see, a lot of artists get locked up out here on some, like, dumb I do be seeing it. Though. Yeah, like. That's Even when crazy. artists come to visit yeah, like hip -hop and shit. Yeah, hip-hop police be on that. Hip-hop police. Yeah. yeah. we got They got separate cops for that out here. I don't know if they got that out there. That's No, I'm pretty sure. No, we don't have that. Cause <laughs> what did hip-hop ever do to you? <laughs> you know, now I start a whole fucking police unit. Nah, they yeah. on that. When drill music was buzzing out here, they was trying to send everybody to jail. I'm gonna keep it a break. I'm gonna say this while I'm up here too, so I don't say I don't like y'all drill music. Okay, you wanna elaborate? Yeah, like, cause it's no, it's no like I'm trying to get the story of what happened, and it's just a whole lot of you feel me. Like if you listen to like other drill stories, you be like, okay, he named him, he died, so happening. Okay, I can pretty much put it together. Down here is just like. Damn, what happened? <laughs> like, really, it's just a whole well, lot of like. It was. It didn't start off like that. I get you mad, but what happened? Though? Like, <laughs> you feel me? It didn't start off like that. Like before, it was real specific. Yeah, cause I used to listen to Fifty Cent and shit. You know? I wasn't even talking about Fifty Cent. I'm talking about like drill music, like okay. in the beginning, cause Brooklyn drill kind of started the all the drill right now. Yeah. Yeah. So in Brooklyn, it was real specific. That side don't mess with that side. I used to listen to it when it was just Brooklyn, I think. Right. If you listen to it now, it is very confusing. Yeah. Like, you probably be confused. Do you, what drill artist you know of or heard of? K Flock. We used to listen. I used to have my phone playing K Flock down in Marfa. That's it. 
Man, I photoshopped uh, a lot. It was a couple New York artists. K Flop. Uh, not just drill on them. Okay, who else? And you say you don't listen to girls, so I'm not even about to name What's girls. the, uh, <laughs> Chef G them? Yeah, Chef G just got I like idea. a couple of the, couple in the other one. Sleepy Hollow? Yeah, I like a couple of their songs. They got like, they got, they they more like melodic. Yeah, you that's your vibe. Saying? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Back. Like that type of music I can, cause they not, you feel me? Yeah, they cool go out. I ain't gonna lie to who said, what song that was? I don't know, man. We were mocking that song for like a whole week, me and my crew. We were like, don't run, don't trip. <laughs> I'm trying to see what, who yeah. saying it. That's K-Block. K-Block. Yeah, yeah that's why we were saying this shit. Who listen to him? Yeah. We used to be saying this shit a lot. Okay. That's good. You fucking with some of them. <laughs> you in tune. Yeah, that shit be, I be fucking with some of that shit. When it be, you can understand what's going on. You feel me? Okay. He's going to keep slandering New York, guys. So... <laughs> Tell people where to follow you. How can they tune in? Instagram, Nudo5. Okay. You be on the gram? You be on TikTok? No. You don't be on TikTok? My TikTok ran by some man. Oh, wow. So I, 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 if I got to do videos, it's going to be me doing the videos. Not for TikTok, though. Okay. Right. I need to start being here. I don't know how to make videos on that bit. It is confusing. Yeah. Are you a social media type person? No. That's why. That's why. So, project on the way, May tenth, five minutes of fame. Appreciate your album. Yeah. Appreciate you. You just woke me up with the conversation. I was Good. sleeping in the car. That's great. <laughs>